Is it time to buy or sell Google stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Google. Our initial report was published on our website on Tuesday, September 12, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since July 25, 2023, our system has ranked Google as a buy candidate, giving it a score of 1.27. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. Those who followed our analysis would have enjoyed an impressive gain of 10.74% since we first listed Google as a buy candidate 35 days ago. This translates to an average return of 0.31% per day since it was listed as buy candidate. The stock lies in the middle of a strong rising trend in the short term and a further rise within the trend is signaled. The current three-month trend suggests a potential 14.01% change over the next three months, with a possible return between 8.41% and 15.57%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a 44.74% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between 20.15% and 46.61%. This translates to a price range of $162.61 to $198.42 after a year. Our latest daily update for Google includes the headline, Google Stock Downgraded to Buy Candidate. The Google stock price fell by minus 1.15% on the last day, Tuesday, September 12, 2023, from $136.92 to $135.34. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 1.24% from a day low at $135.19 to a day high of $136.87. The price has risen in 7 of the last 10 days and is up by 3.31% over the past 2 weeks. Volume fell on the last day along with the stock, which is actually a good sign as volume should follow the stock. On the last day, the trading volume fell by minus 2 million shares and in total, 17 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $2.30 billion. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $137.48, and the lowest price was $83.34. Currently, the price is 1.55%, or $2.13, below the 52-week high, and 94.47%, or $2,313.58, below the all-time high on June 14, 2021, when the price reached $2,448.92. Analyst Ratings On Wednesday, August 30, 2023, it was reported that Citigroup gave Google a buy grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, August 30, 2023, it was reported that KeyBank gave Google a overweight grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, July 26, 2023, it was reported that Needham gave Google a overweight grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, July 26, 2023, it was reported that Needham gave Google a buy grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, July 26, 2023, it was reported that KeyBank gave Google a overweight grade with a hold action. Analysts have given Google stock a general buy rating. They rate the P-E ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a neutral rating. The following signals have been identified for Google. The Google stock holds a sell signal from the short-term moving average. At the same time, however, there is a buy signal from the long-term average. Since the short-term average is above the long-term average there is a general buy signal in the stock giving a positive forecast for the stock. On further gains, the stock will meet resistance from the short-term moving average at approximately $135.68. On a fall, 
the stock will find some support from the long-term average at approximately $131.39. A breakup through the short-term average will send a buy signal, whereas a breakdown through the long-term average will send a sell signal. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Monday, September 11, 2023, and so far it has fallen minus 1.15%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Volume fell together with the price during the last trading day and this reduces the overall risk as volume should follow the price movements. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal. Pivots, sell signal 2 days ago. Bollinger, buy signal 7 days ago. Short-term moving average, sell signal 2 days ago. Long-term moving average, buy signal 36 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Buy signal 40 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average, buy signal 12 days ago. The long-term moving average, buy signal 126 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Buy signal 121 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Google Google finds support from accumulated volume at $129.78 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock is usually traded at a good volume, and with minor daily changes, the risk is considered to be low. During the last day, the stock moved $1.68, 1.24%, between high and low. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 1.59%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Google, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per-share earnings. A relatively low P-E ratio could signal a low expectation for the future of the company or that the stock is undervalued, indicating a potential buying opportunity. In other news, the next earnings report for Q3 2023 is expected on October 23, 2023. Analysts' consensus estimates are at $1.45. Keep an eye on these numbers, as they can greatly impact stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Google. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Google is at $135.88. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Google encounters its first support level at $129.78. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Google from multiple analyst sources is buy. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. On August 3, 2023, Hennessy John L. conducted an insider buy of 2,444 shares of Class C capital stock. On September 11, 2023, Hennessy John L. conducted an insider sell of 54 shares of Class C capital stock. On September 11, 2023, Hennessy John L. conducted an insider sell of 146 shares of Class C capital stock. On August 3, 2023, Hennessy John L. conducted an insider sell of 2,444 shares of Class C capital stock. On September 6, 2023, Walker John Kent conducted an insider buy of 42,900 shares of Class C capital stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be negative with a ratio of minus 92.415. Overall, insiders purchased 300,909 shares and sold 7,506,876 shares in the last 100 trades. 
Our recommended stop loss is set at $129.79, minus 4.10%. This stock has low daily movements and this gives low risk. There is a sell signal from a pivot top found one day ago. Is Google stock a good buy? Several short-term signals, along with a general good trend, are positive and we conclude that the current level may hold a buying opportunity as there is a fair chance for Google stock to perform well in the short term. Due to some small weaknesses in the technical picture we have downgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a strong buy to a buy candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Wednesday, September 13th, we expect Google to open up $0.460 and start trading at $135.80. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.